Good morning, boys and girls. So good to welcome you back today. Not one, not two, but three of our Christmas journeys, working through the Scottish Bible Society material in the run up to Christmas. Now, Christmas is great, isn't it? I know we're getting more and more excited. The closer we get to Christmas, we're getting more and more excited. But I've got my Christmas joke for you. I know you're more excited about that, aren't you? No? What do you mean, no? Right, here's today's. How much does Santa pay to park a sleigh? Nothing. It's on the house. Okay, 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 okay. I know that was bad. I know it was bad. That was bad. I know. But to the more serious stuff, to the best, most exciting news ever, the birth of Jesus. Today we're going to read in Luke chapter 2, verses 3 to 7. We're told, Everyone went to their own town to be listed. Joseph went also. He went from the town of Nazareth and Galilee to Judea, that's where Bethlehem, the town of David, was. Joseph went there because he belonged to the family line of David. He went there with Mary to be listed. Mary was engaged to him. She was expecting a baby. While Joseph and Mary were there, the time came for the child to be born. She gave birth to her first baby. It was a boy. She wrapped him in large strips of cloth, then she placed him in a manger. That's because there was no guest room where they could stay. So Mary and Joseph had to go on this long journey and that must have been very difficult. Mary was so close to having her baby and yet they had to go on this long journey back to a town of Bethlehem and that's the, the town where Joseph's family was originally from. And they had to go there because the Roman Empire that controlled them at that time was taking what's called a census, like a record of all the people who lived there. Now they had to go back there because this was where Joseph's family were from. And in the, the pack today, it asks us to make a list of the people in our families, to do a little family tree for ourselves. Some of our families might be really big. Some of us might have families that are really small. But the amazing thing in the Bible is this, that being part of God's family doesn't depend on, on who we're related to. Being part of God's family depends only on one thing, that we love Jesus. That if you or I love Jesus and we trust Jesus, it doesn't matter who we are or where we're from, the Bible's promise is this, we are part of God's family. We are part of Jesus' great family and all we have to do is believe. That's an amazing promise for us to think about this Christmas. So today we're asked to stick a star and we're to put the star on Bethlehem. So we're down here in the wee box, if you can see, and here is Bethlehem. So I'm going to put the star over Bethlehem. There we go. Now today's world journey we're going to read about Tarore. Tarore lived in New Zealand nearly 200 years ago. Now I know I look old but I wasn't around then. She was given the book of Luke from the Bible in her own language, a language called Maori. She treasured the little book and wore it round her neck in what's called a, a kete, a traditional Maori basket. She read it to her village so everybody could hear the story of Jesus. Isn't that an amazing thing? At church just this morning, we were singing a song, Go Tell It on the Mountains. Go tell everybody that Jesus is born. Doesn't matter how old you are or how young you are, God says to all of us, Go tell everybody about Jesus. Go tell everybody what you know so that they can find out how to get to heaven as well. And there we have this Tarore, 200 years ago, when she found out about Jesus, she shared with everybody that she knew. Now, we're going to put a sticker on New Zealand. Anyone know where New Zealand is? Anyone know where Old Zealand is? No, neither do I. New Zealand, so we're going down here, there's Australia here, and then just down from Australia, there's New Zealand in the bottom of our map, so we're going to put a star over New Zealand. Now, that's us for day three, so we're just going to say a wee prayer, and then uh, we'll see you tomorrow. So let's pray together. Lord Jesus, thank you for the example of Tarore, that you would help us too, to tell everyone that we meet, everyone around us, our family, our friends, our teachers, whoever it might be, about the Lord Jesus Christ who came into this world to rescue us. And it's so amazing that you would love us so much to do all that you've done for us. So bless everyone, Lord, and 
Bless all the boys and girls who watch these videos. And we ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. See you tomorrow, guys. Bye.